Appelle-moi l'aigle, ou même si tu veux la perdre. Depuis que je suis que l'amour n'a pas de prix, à cœur ouvert, je te fais une révélation, mon frère, je prie. Pour que le Seigneur dissipe nos peines, nos haines, nos gênes, et qu'il nous insuffle de l'amour, de la sympathie dans nos gènes. Et saviez-vous que j'écris, je photographie par amour Raison pour laquelle je ne cesse de vous inviter à rejoindre mon carafeau. Plein de love. love. Où il n'existe pas de différence entre l'enfant de Swaziland et de Singapour. Parole de l'aigle, dragon cracheur de feu, aigle illuminé chez Moussa Touré, Gadaï. My name is Israel Dejani. Uh, I'm uh, an Ethiopian uh, and the founder of Magavi Skate. Uh, Magavi Skate is uh, it's a skateboarding community uh, empowering the youth through skateboarding. I, I always wanted to give back to my community. I always wanted to come back to the place where I grew up, you know, and learn make an impact, I just want to give up in some way, even before I started skateboarding. So, but I didn't know how to communicate with the kids and everything until I got the skateboard. So skateboard become a cool way of getting to know that the younger generation who are, you know, uh, on, the, on the street, who are running on trouble at the young age, you know, 11, 12, even younger, you know, just the, the neighborhood where I grew up. Uh, It's beautiful, but the other side is also like, it's really, uh, there's nothing that inspires the youth. And to help them see dream, you know, for the youth who have, who doesn't have like people to mentor them or uh, show them and guide them, uh, it's also, you know, a hard place to, to live in. You need uh, people who would uh, make a difference through uh, providing a positive outlet the youth, like when you pay attention, when you listen to the youth and know that they have something to say and respect what they have to say and hear them, like it, it empowers them. Uh, yeah, so I always advise the youth, you know, uh, it doesn't matter how big or small things that you do, but you do it with love and you do it with, you know, good intention. But when I first started, I just had a single board that I brought from Sweden when I first traveled to Europe. Uh, so a friend of mine called Tobias, he gave me uh, his board and I brought it back home and, 
you know, started skating in the neighborhood and just like that became like a way of communicating. And I asked my parents like, you know, if it's cool to bring my the kids in there super happy they're happy that I'm doing this and they encourage me and so they let me use the entire their house and the backyard so we skate on the street and then, you know come back to the neighborhood and uh, uh, to the to the to the backyard talk about different stuff you know it's just like I told them how I grew up when I was a kid how I used to be when I was on their age and uh, it's it's just you know Pretty much like, you know, breaking up the shells, you know, it's like there is so much more you can do, you know, like it's not only like what you see. Once in a month we have this dream big, and but once in a week we have make somebody happy day. So this make somebody happy day, it is, uh, it's, it's an intentional act in the neighborhood. Like we all get together after the skate session, we go around the neighborhood and help out, just do a free good things around the neighborhood. All the neighborhood, they think like, all oh, the skaters, kids, who make somebody happy? You know, it's just like, it's really cool. Like, uh, it's, it's becoming really dope and positive. It's surrounded by a positive culture. To empower the girls and uh, to make a, an impact on the girls, it's going to make a huge difference because like the very important part of my life who make a big impact is my mother, uh, like how she has been helping me like when I was going through stuff and then like how she's been like being there for me like uh, in the very craziest times and uh, and my sister Mulukan, she's my younger sister but she's like like amazing she's the wisest girl I know and uh, yeah she is also she, she 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 was with me when I started this she was taking care of the girls like you know after the girls the skating and everything they go and look up to her and uh, she she have helped them facilitate and they talk about different issues you know when they became teenagers and everything and like she she's basically guardian. yeah she's she's a guardian she's a guardian for this youth but with Mugabe skate i see you know this is uh, an is an institution and you know i've got like this great movement in it you know so like happening this Mugabe skate like all over the world you know it's, it's it's not my work anymore it's not only my work anymore you know now it's the youth of Ethiopia is uh, carrying that that torch and just like lighting up all over the world you know so like I see that just spreading every uh, all over the world and just making an impact they're doing uh, they're they're even doing better than what I did like I started something with this and then they can do like you know on top of that they build their things and then I want to see this light shining everywhere so uh, that's my uh, my dream to see in 20 years. Thank you.
Thank you.